Today, what are we doing, Isaac? We are going fishing. Yes. And it's your, is it your first time fishing ever? Or is it, it, it is? Yeah. Oh, very cool. So, me and Tiff recently got into fishing. We just bought fishing rods and our good friend, Andrew, he's been fishing a lot lately. I think it's one of those things where like you're in quarantine and there's just not a whole lot to do and you're just looking for things to do. And one of the things that he decided to pick up was fishing and he dragged us out to go fishing one time and we're like man this is really really fun and so now me and tiff got our own fishing rods we even got isaac one tiff is doing podcast stuff today so she won't be joining us but it will be a boys night out fishing and then andrew's joining us what are you looking forward to the most um, catching a fish catching a fish and eating it and eating it Ooh, that'd be really really fun i've always been really really interested in that kind of lifestyle whether it be fishing or hunting uh like hunting for your own food and stuff like that's something that's always piqued my interest it's kind of like this you know survivalist kind of mentality and just being able to you know handle yourself if there weren't any stores and stuff and just you know rely on nature that's always been really really cool oh and by the way the world looks like it's ending all right well, we're at the pier we got Isaac set up over here you got your little weight you got your little uh, your rig over there what kind of uh, what kind of bait we using today we're using squid squid have, have you had any luck yet so far with uh, getting any bites no because um, whenever I cast it out uh -huh. I ends up getting stuck for some reason Oh really? Are you still trying to practice? Yeah. yeah. It takes a little getting used to. I think right here it's like. Stuck. Oh, it got stuck on the. That's the anchor. That's where you tie the the string to it. And it just takes practice, and it just takes a lot of getting to know your uh, fishing rod. Yeah. Oh, there you go. You just did it. Nice. You got AK over here. How you doing, sir? Nada. Nada. Nothing today. Nothing. Nothing. I'm one bite. I know. I think the fishes are kind of like. It's too gloomy to go eating food today. Is, is it ashy out here at all? It's not ashy? It is. It is right where I live. I, can't, I don't see it here. Yeah, it, it's, it actually feels nice. It, it feels like the, the weather here is a lot better too. Like you can breathe a lot better because out where we are, it's like you can't breathe. It's like it feels like you're being suffocated by the smoke and the ashes and stuff. Yeah. Nice little break from all that. Nothing's biting today, by the way. This thing just fell off my fishing pole. And didn't know that this part of a fishing pole could actually break off. And it's actually broke. I can't screw it back in or anything. So, great. So much for going cheap on buying fishing poles. I'm starting to like fishing as a hobby. So, thinking I'm gonna stop by like a, a real fishing store and get a decent fishing pole. Oh, that was a good cast. You're getting pretty good. You learn quick. Yeah. I think your fishing pole broke too. <laughs> That's hilarious. Bring it in. Oh my goodness. Oh, wait, no, 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 it didn't break. It didn't break? Oh, no, I did. I think it snapped off, yeah. Look, it snapped, it, off. It snapped off. Two fishing poles broke on the same ah. trip. The luck we have. Honestly, I think it's we should just probably have spent more on a decent fishing pole. Yeah. That's so funny. Both our fishing poles broke. I mean, yours, yours mainly broke. Mine is still usable. Yours isn't. Yeah, you're just missing the, the one on the end, the tip. Should have known. It's made in China. Ah. Hey, what's up, buddy? What's up? I don't got nothing for you. Give him a whole squid. There we go. Fishies don't want to come out and eat. At least we get to feed someone else. There you go. Happy eating. Now he's just waiting for us to throw more food. Oh, he did something bad. <laughs> yeah, he's like a dog. It's a sea dog. All right, so after trying to get our own fishies, we decided to pay for some fishies and we're gonna eat some seafood at the pier. It's weird because as I'm trying to fish, I'm always like getting hungry and like wanting to eat fish. Is that a thing? Like as you're fishing, you, is like, do you do you normally get hungry when you fish and you want to eat fish? I feel like I always want to eat fish. You always want to eat fish. A little different. I don't, I don't always crave fish, but when I do, I really, really want it. And fishing brings that out of me for some reason like I just really have to, like last time when we went fishing we had we had the, the, the fish taco that was a must-have what about you 
Yeah. Yeah, you actually craved seafood today, which is something that you never crave for. So at home, Isaac and Tiff rarely ever eat seafood and never crave it. I'm using this as an in with you, Isaac. I'm gonna get you to like seafood, and then we're gonna be uh, seafood buddies moving forward. We'll fish and then mm -hmm. get some seafood. True. And then sitting next to these guys, I'm like, man, we should have ordered a, a fat ass uh, main lobster. <laughs> these things are huge. That one right there, uh -huh. the next to the main lobster looks like a giant grasshopper. That one right here? Yeah. <laughs> True. Delicious, gigantic sea bugs. Look at that. Clam soup, that's all you like it. That looks so good. It smells like the ocean. It does. Oh, <laughs> This is exactly what I wanted. I think seafood is the one food slash animal that when I look at it when it's alive, I'm already salivating. But I can't look at a chicken like that and I can't look, look at a cow like that. But when I look at lobsters crawling around or fish swimming around, I'm already salivating. How's the soup? Pretty good. Pretty good? Yeah. Oh, I can smell your, your soup smells really, really good. Flavor of the sea. That is delicious. Oh, wow, that's so good. Yeah, we, did, we didn't catch any fish, but now we, uh, we're eating at the pier. Yeah, we ate some seafood because we were craving what we were supposed to catch, even though we were going to catch and release, but we we're just craving the potential of having a dinner that we would have caught. So now we're living our fantasies by paying for it at a restaurant. 